Hello YouTube, it's Justin Case here and today I'm going to be showing you how to install the White Door firmware. Before we get started, let me give you a little rundown on what White Door is. White Door is pretty much just modded 3.1.3 made to look and feel like iOS 4. It offers a variety of features that iOS 4 has like folders and multitasking. It also, also offers emoji and in my next video I'll be uh, giving a little preview of what it is in case you're not sure you want to install it yet. In order to download, make sure you have your iPhone connected to your computer or iPod. Go to the download section of whitedoor.com and scroll down till you see iPhone 2G, 3G, iPod Touch 1G, and iPod Touch 2G MB. White Door is not compatible with the iPod Touch 2G MC model and it's not compatible with the 3GS and up. If you are on 4.2.1, you should be able to downgrade and install White Door. I have a 2G, so we're just going to go over here to the drop down menu. Now you can select which one you want. We offer the op Apple Original 3.1.2 and 3.1.3 .3 firmware. The unlocked without MMS. Unlocked with MMS is currently not available and neither is the normal with MMS. However, if you visit our forums, there is a tutorial on how to manually enable it. Unlocked is if you have a legit SIM card for iTunes activation and unlocked is if you want to activate it and use it without a SIM card or an unofficial carrier. Same for the iPhone 3G. There is no unlocked iOS 4 base for the 3G, however we have a beta ready for download, it's finally here. The iPod Touch offers light and full and same for the iPod Touch 2G. We don't have iOS 4 base for that yet, so keep on waiting. The light version offers less features than the full version, but they are j both just about the same speed. Light is supposedly a little bit faster though. You can download the White Door firmware from these sources. We host them on external servers, not our own site. Once you have the firmware downloaded, make sure you extract it with WinRAR and drag it to your desktop. It should be right here. iPhone 1, comma 1, White Door 4.3.1 firmware.ipsw. Then go to iTunes, hold the shift button down why you click restore then go to your desktop browse for the firmware that you selected I mean that you downloaded I'm sorry and open I'm not gonna open it because I already have white door installed and I don't want to restore my phone right now then all you should have to do is just wait for the install to complete if you get 1600 errors then all you need to do is visit the white door forum and read tutorials on how to do the iRev method. I might make a video for that later. If that doesn't work, reinstall stock 3.1.2, jailbreak with black rain, and try it again. If that doesn't work, then install stock 3.1.3 and try to run it a third time. If this tutorial was confusing to you or you have any questions, go ahead and hit me up on the White Door forum. I'm on pretty much all day and I'll be free to answer your questions. So if you have any questions, just hit me up on the White Door Farm and I'll be there. So thanks for watching. I hope I helped you. Comment, rate, and subscribe.